During today's Coast Region Tour, Coast to Secretary General Francis Atoli joined Azimio la Umoja in campaigning for Raila's presidency. He stated that the DP William Ruto will not receive even 20% of the Western Region votes. According to Atoli, with time flying by, Deputy President William Ruto will not be president. This is not strange because the Kotu leader has always been against William Somoe Arap Ruto. But will the odds change? Do Kenyans know whom they want? Do you know whom you want to vote in and why? Must you be told whom to vote in or you have weighed yourself and come up with a plan? And what is that strategy? <laughs> Bas 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 thank you very much thank you very much wacha tuelewane eh? ili wengine wawasikize si namna hivyo nyinyi mmepata nafasi kubwa sana ya kumkaribisha rais wa tano wa jamhuri ya Kenya Raila Odinga Mimi Mheshimiwa the 50th president nataka kukuambia ya kwamba mimi mwenyewe ni moja wapo wakazi wa hapa Kilifi na hawa watu wa Kilifi ni watu wazuri sana nimekaa na hao sijaona watu wazuri kuliko watu wa kilifi ni watu ambao wana uaminifu ni watu wadalifu wadilifu na ni watu sawa na mimi najua kikwambia watakupatia kura watakupa kura na mimi nataka kuambia wewe shida yao kubwa ni mambo ya ardhi na uwezi kumpa chui mbuzi useme chui atalinda mbuzi yako kuna julikana wazi ya kwamba bwana Ruto na Arab mashamba leo chagua yeye shida ya mashamba pwani itasidi watu kunyanyazwa kutazidi angalia kama kule kwetu magharibi Amewaambia bwana Msali Amdabadi Moses Wetangula Dr. Kaluare na wengine ambao walihamia huko kwenda kwake ya kwamba wakiwa watapatiwa 30 kwa mia katika serikali yake ni lazima wampe sabuni kwa mia ya wafuasi ama support ya wale watu wa magharibi watatoa wapi kama sio kudanganywa kwa mchana hiyo wale watu wote ambao wamehamia huko wamepatiwa conditions usipofanya hii kupati hii usipofanya hii na sasa wanafikiria sana tutatoka namna gani na sisi wenyewe tulijicommit jana citizen tv ilieleza kwa usawa kwa ukamilifu ya kwamba condition gani ambazo ziko katika ile memorandum of understanding kati ya William Ruto na wale wanaamia kwake na mimi nataka kuambia hivi mja, mchana mwaka wa mbili na nne mimi niliambia wa Kenya ya kwamba William Samoei Ruto hata kuwa president wa tano wa Kenya You can take it to the bank. You can take it to the bank. You can take it to the bank. Kwa nini hawezi kupata hiyo nafasi? Kwa ajili yeye alitumia mambo ya uongo, mambo ya kumkashifu mkubwa wake, mambo ya kuleta uongo kabisa kwa wakenya. Angalia kila siku yeye huwa anaambia nyinyi, ambieni huyo mse wa kitenda bidi ya kwamba sisi ye ni mtu anataka madaraka sisi watu wa, wa watu wa, wa uda na watu wa Kenya kwa Kenya kuisha sisi mambo yetu ni ya kwamba hatutaki mamlaka 
huyo yande ya mambo yake ni ya madaraka hii mambo watu wanajitakia makubwa Sa sasa jana aligawa jana alijulikana ni nani atakuwa chief minister ni nani atakuwa hiki na kile na hiki na kile na pia na condition lazima ufanye hii yeye muongo sana yeye muongo sana na sisi tunawasihi vijana duniani mzima kwa watadisi wa mambo ya uchumi na wengi wenu mmesoma katika Pwani University na university zote za ulimwangu hakuna uchumi unaweza kujenga ukitumia watu wa chini bottoms up hiyo madaraka yake ya jana atuambie mama mboga mama boda boda mama wilibaro mtu wa chini fichana hamna mtu amepeana sasa namna hivyo Mumusikiza, musisikiza yeye hapa namna gani? Musisikiza yeye. Na waomba tarehe tisa mwezi wa nane muamke mapema na mlinde vipande vyenu kura ni ya Raila Amolo Odinga. Ukimaliza mkipiga kura mzuri nataka kuambia watu wa Kilifi. Ile shida iko hapa the fifth president ni mambo ya school fees ya watoto. Wewe na waahidi mkimchagua Raila Amolo Odinga tutakuwa na center hapa kubwa ya kupeana elimu ya bure kwa watoto wenu tukishirikiana na gavana wenu Mungaro. Sawa si sawa? Sawa si sawa? Sawa si sawa? Sawa. Shanti sana jeni.